Hello, my friends. Oh, welcome back to my channel, Diamonds and Washi. My name is Katie, and if you are new here, hello and welcome. I hope you'll consider subscribing for lots more diamond painting content. And if you are back, welcome back. Today I'm here with a sneak peek unboxing from Diamond Art Club for one of their new releases this weekend. So thanks to Diamond Art Club for sending this over for me to share with you all ahead of the weekend's release. I have a really beautiful kit to share with you guys today that I remember from voting a while back. This is called Away From It All and is by Ivy Dolamore. This one's going to have square diamonds, 55.8 by 74 centimeters or 22 point by 29 inches. And I am beyond excited. I will confess, I am pretty seriously thinking about starting this one right away. <laughs> I've gotten this in a few days early. And so we'll see. We'll see once I open it up. This kit, along with the other new releases, are going to be coming out tomorrow, which is Saturday, July 22nd at 9.30 a.m. Pacific, 12.30 p.m. Eastern. That's the general release time. If you're in the Ruby or Diamond tier of the rewards program, you do get an early access window of about half an hour to 45 minutes. You'll get an email or a text. Uh, just make sure you're checking on that uh, and you'll get that early access window. So anyway, this is going to have square diamonds. Diamond Art Club has some blue branding that comes with that. On the back, there's some information about how to diamond paint your kit contents. And then here's a QR code that will uh, take you to a 10% off discount count. Uh, now, if you're brand new to Diamond Art Club, I'm thinking of making your very first purchase. I do have a discount code you're welcome to use for 20% off your first purchase. It's just my name, Katie, K-A-T-I-E, and the number 20. And like I said, 20% off your very first purchase. Please don't feel obligated, though. There's, um, I may make a small commission that always goes right back into my channel, but you'll see some other discount codes in this video. I just recommend taking advantage of, of one of them. So... Anyway, and thanks in advance if you do happen to use that that code. So let's take a look. Diamond Art Club always includes a nice kind of luxurious toolkit here that comes with everything you need to do your diamond painting and, and then some, I feel like. Uh, so you're going to get a pen and squishy. The color on those is going to vary. And then you also get some thin plastic multi-placers if you want to try your hand at placing more than one diamond at a time. You got some wax, which by the way, don't forget to take off the thin plastic film there before you try to load up your pen. You're also going to get, oh, there it is. <clears throat> I've got a tray and this is a tray stopper you can pop in to help stop your diamonds from sliding out. I've also got a bag of baggies, resealable bags, if you wanna put your diamonds into those. And then we've got a pair of branded tweezers. They are pretty sharp, so do keep that cover on there. And the Diamond Art Club also includes these two fun goodies, which this is a roll of washi tape, which incidentally is going to match this kit really beautifully. The print on this will vary. I have a video dedicated to how I use washi tape. I'll link it below, um, but I use it to section off my canvas and uh, to go around the border as well in case there's any glue that goes past the edge of the drill field just prevents dirt or dust from getting in there this is the cover minder there are magnets on the back and if you take this one off slide it under the section of the canvas that you're working on set the canvas back down peel back the plastic cover set that on top of your peeled back plastic cover and you will have a cute little companion that is also very practical so that's that's everything in our toolkit and then Diamond Art Club also includes this smaller logbook sticker. I like that it has the name and the artist's name and the thumbnail of the, of the original artwork. I use this in my paper logbook once I start working on a kit. Some people will use it on the side of the box to help organize their stash, or I'm sure you could find something else crafty to do with it as well. Everything else is gonna be included in this bag. Let's take a look. The canvas backing, so incredibly soft. So soft and plush. All right, so let's unroll. Ooh, oh, she's so pretty already. Look at all those blues. Oh my gosh, gorgeous. Let's flip it sideways just for the moment. Wow, oh my gosh, look at that rainbow of colors. So, 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 so pretty. I'll give you a better look at it in just a moment. But first, okay, we got a big bag of diamonds here. We'll look at those more closely in just a bit. Uh, we're also going to have included a pamphlet with some helpful info in it that you can get from the founder, some info about what's included in your kit, a beginner video. I've also got one that I'll have linked below in the description box. 
Uh, QR code that'll take you to the VIP Facebook group, which is a great resource to join once you've made your very first purchase. A set of step-by-step instructions written out for you, some tips and tricks. There's one of those discount codes again. And (laughs) info about the mobile app, which you do get 20% off your first purchase through the app as well. Also included will be a sticker sheet, or in this case, two sticker sheets, because this is gonna be quite the colorful canvas. Uh, So on your sticker sheet, you're gonna have the title. In this case, it's Away From It All, and the artist's name, Ivy Dolamore. A spot to write your start and end date, and look at this beautiful original artwork. So you can kind of see better the details of what else is going on in the room. But then all of the color is happening right here. Uh, Square diamonds, here's the stats and the skew. The second sticker sheet is going to be exactly the same, just with the continuation of the colors. Now, the color code system you see here comes from the DMC color code system, the DMC brand of Floss. And uh, that's what most diamond painting companies use. In Diamond Art Club's numbering system though, anything under the number 150 is gonna be a special kind of diamond called an AB. And uh, I will tell you more about those when we're actually looking at the diamonds. These are all pre-cut labels for you as well. And then we go down to here. So pretty. So 73 colors in all, very colorful. Diamond Art Club used to max out at 67 colors, decided they wanted to go a bit bigger and they thought we'll just include a second sticker sheet. (laughs) Make it easy, make it easy. So if your canvas, by the way, is wanting to roll up on the edges, that happens a lot when a canvas gets rolled and packed, you can help it lay flat by rolling it the opposite direction. Diamond Art Club uses poured glue on their canvases, so this is totally safe to do. You're not hurting the glue or the canvas material. They also have a self-flattening feature, so you could just wait and it would lay flat on its own without any trouble. There's that beauty, oh my gosh. Look at how pretty, tons of blues in this kit. And of course we do have some of the rainbow colors, but I think you gotta like the color blue. (laughs) So let me take you on a little tour of the canvas itself and the features. So we have their branding at the top, Do It Makes You Sparkle, Diamond Art Club. The edge of the canvas here is scalloped and finished. You shouldn't have to worry about any fraying with the poking and everything like that. The back, like I mentioned earlier, it's really, really soft and plush. And the material overall on the canvas is just, it feels like a kind of a luxurious, kind of premium level material. It's sturdy, but malleable. It holds the diamonds really beautifully and uh, is really nice to work on. Diamond Art Club uses poured glue, like I mentioned. It's really sticky. I never have issues with diamonds falling off my Diamond Art Club canvases. Um, And then we've got our giant color list on the side, 73 colors, and the same one over here on the bottom right. And then here at the bottom left, we've got a thumbnail of the original artwork, the title and the size, and then copyright Ivy Dolamore. Now what this means, this is really important, is that Ivy Dolamore, the artist, has both given permission for the use of her artwork by Diamond Art Club and is being compensated for it. Diamond Art Club legally licenses all of the artwork that they use and That's really important because a lot of diamond painting companies out here don't do that. So I appreciate when companies like Diamond Art Club are doing right by artists. Here we've got links to their socials and yet another discount code. And here is info about their lifetime warranty. As long as you're the original owner and purchaser of your kit, you're covered under that lifetime warranty. And that includes if you happen to run out of a drill color or have any trouble with the glue or the canvas or anything like that, you can contact their customer service and look at you taken care of. So looking up close, look at those pretty paints. <laughs> I hope we'll have some ABs in there. I bet we will. I bet the numbers are ABs if I had to if I had to guess. The printing is really clear with their symbols. You can see it's a mix of alphanumeric and excuse me. And non-alphanumeric. We do have some color blocking going on in here. Here's a good example. Uh, so color blocking is when you have Lots of the same color in a small area, like here, this little lowercase a. These areas will tend to go a little bit faster because you can multi-place and you'll have that color in your tray for longer. By contrast, her hair is a really good example. Uh, We do have some confetti as well. Confetti is when you have lots of color changes in a small area. You'll be doing a bit more single placing and changing out the color in your tray a bit more often. The payoff though is that, and the trade-off is that you do get a a lot more detail that way. I like to have a nice mix of color blocking and confetti in my canvases because, like I always say (laughs) in every video because I just think it's fun, Uh, confetti keeps it interesting, but color blocking keeps it moving. I love the swirls of rainbowy color. That's gorgeous. 
So yeah, it looks like this kit has a good mix of both, honestly. And I love that. So printing looks really clear. And this canvas, gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So let's do a quick measurement just to make sure we're true to size. Diamond Art Club canvases usually are, but I do like to double check. And we are at about 74 centimeters left to right, and we're listed as 74 centimeters. And then we're just shy of 56 centimeters, and it's listed as 55.8. Yeah, I'm gonna call it true to size. Okay, <laughs> let's take a look at these diamond colors. I especially want to find those AB colors. So here's our, our color spread again. There is a sticker on the side in case you store these separate from the canvas outside the box they came in. Easy enough to match it up again later. Or, you know, just look for all the blues and purples. <laughs> So there we go again. There's a couple little straggler packs over here. Let me see. Okay. So right off the bat, we just have this little strand that just has four packs. And I did notice this is a recent addition. They started adding lines under the DMC. This is the DMC code. And that's because occasionally you'll have some numbers that just are mix mixes of sixes and nines. And obviously, you know, if you flip it upside down, it could be confusing. So just a little addition, but nice to see them. Uh, listen to some uh, so to feedback, I think. <laughs> so let's get into the rest of these. Now, these are square diamonds, like I mentioned, you guys. Diamond Art Club does manufacture all their diamonds in-house, both their round and squares. And they're resin diamonds and have a really beautiful sparkly effect. Now, if you're curious, I did do a video a little a little while back, but not that, not that long ago where actually I completed the same kit in both round and square drills from Diamond Art Club because they are occasionally offering kits the same artwork in both drill shapes. So if you're curious to see the different sort of finished effect of squares versus rounds, I will link to that video below. You guys, here's our first special diamond, 101. So this is an AB diamond, and AB stands for Aurora Borealis. These are named after the Northern Lights, which have a beautiful shimmery and iridescent color shift effect. And that coating on the tops of these has that same kind of idea going. The areas these have been charted, it's going to dry your eye to those areas and highlight them really beautifully. And it does reflect a kind of a variety of rainbowy colors too. So that's our first one, 101. It's a pretty blue, kind of with a hint of gray to it. There's the end of that strand. And then we got three bags of 939, which is this really dark blue color. Like I said, every shade of blue. One, two, three, four. Four bags of 311. Let's see, three bags of 823. I do find that Diamond Art Club squares are really nice quality. There's pretty minimal trash, you know, diamonds that aren't usable because they have tabs sticking off the side. Uh, they tend to have pretty minimal in that respect. Uh, so 120, you guys, here's our second AB. It's another blue one. This one's got more of an aqua look to it. So pretty. Uh, but I find that I care a lot more about the, the quality and consistency of the shape and size of square diamonds because square diamonds by nature sit up right next to each other really tightly. So if any of them are inconsistent in size or have little bits sticking off the side, it's going to cause issues because there's not enough space for that. And then they'll want to pop like where the edge or corner will kind of pop up off the canvas and they don't lay flat and then they fall off. So Anyway, 130, you guys. There's number three of our ABs. Really pretty, just kind of a true yellow. I'm guessing these are going to be in some of these swirls. They have, they've got to be. They've got to be. <laughs> our fourth AB is a pretty tangerine orange, 132. I really like this AB a lot, actually. You'll see it in a number of Diamond Art Club canvases. I do like it. And then lots of, we got some pinks in here and some browns and, of course, more blues. I love this pink, 224. And then you guys, here at the end of this strand, 141. There's our fifth, fifth and final AB. It's a white AB. This, I would argue, is Diamond Art Club's most popular AB, most, most frequently used AB. It's a white AB. It is just such a good, like, what's the word I'm looking for? 
uh, it, 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 it does all the things. <laughs> it's a good, just like go to, maybe that's what I'm looking for. So I love one for one. It's a great AB. So <laughs> five ABs in this kit, two shades of blue, a yellow, orange, and a white, but we're not done yet. We do have this strand of a nice variety of colors that kind of come in slightly smaller amounts. Diamond Art Club does put their diamonds roughly in order of weight. It's not all perfect. You know, we saw some of the packets that had less attached to the ones that had more. But this one is kind of steadily going down into those ones that we just have just a tiny handful. Diamond Art Club does include um, extras, so you shouldn't run out. But if you do, and it has happened before to me, I just contact the customer service and they'll send out replacements. So let's take a look at this canvas together and see where we're going to find those ABs. So right off the bat, you see some white in here. That's our white AB. Uh, there's a blue color right here, which if you look up close, <clears throat> we're looking at the number two right here. That's more of our aqua AB. And then the number one you see here and here is the, uh, the blue AB that has a bit of a gray tone to it here as well. Then we have the uh, aqua blue AB right here. And then over here in the palette, you guys, we've got the orange AB is the number four here and here. The yellow AB is the number three. The white AB is this black dot. And then we have this aqua AB, blue AB right there. And then the stars are the yellow AB. There's a little bit of the grayish blue AB doing some highlighting in the artist's uh, shirt. And then the swirl of white over here is the white AB. This white outline here is white AB. The yellow here is the yellow AB. We have some of the grayish blue AB doing a lot of highlighting in her hair. Here, I'll show you up close. The number one is the, the blue with a slight gray tone AB. In her eyes, we have both of the blue AB colors. We have a little bit of that orange AB, that number four in her hair. These swirls over here we have the yellow AB and the orange AB. Actually, some of the grayish blue AB right here too. A couple of dots of the orange AB up here. <laughs> Swirls of the yellow AB. Do you guys see the aqua AB, the number two that's in there as well? And then we have more, a big chunk of that grayish blue AB. Swirls of the orange and yellow. More of the aqua in there as well. The stars and the yellow you're seeing is all AB. And then the orange AB kind of swirling throughout up here. The number four is that. And then this number one is the grayish blue AB. So exactly, honestly, exactly what I was hoping for. I was just hoping that these beautiful swirls coming off of here would just have lots of ABs laced throughout. And it certainly looks like that is the case. So um, I do like the placement of the white ABs too. And I like that we have some of the ABs in her hair. I think that's gonna have a really pretty highlighting and shimmery effect. And just the magic coming off of the canvas and what she's creating, I think this is gonna be gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. So here's what I'm gonna do now. I'm actually gonna break and I'm gonna go kit this up. I am gonna go ahead and start on it for you guys. I really wanna show you, I try to decide what areas I do wanna work on to be able to show you so that you can see some of these maybe beautiful ABs and everything coming together. So I'll see what I can get done ahead of the release and then I will be back and put in a clip here uh, so you can, can see how it's turning out. All right, you guys, I am back and I did get a nice little section done. So I I really had less than 48 hours and that was including kidding up time uh, to, to work on this. And so I thought, what do I think you guys would most enjoy seeing completed? And so I thought the section kind of with her face and then with some of the rainbow swirls that are going on in the background. And I have to tell you that I, love how the colors turned out. I feel like the camera doesn't do it justice, but they just pop so incredibly beautifully, especially compared to the printing on the canvas. Her hair is these gorgeous shades of purple. You can see some of the blue ABs in there. And then here is just a hint of what that dark blue background effect is going to be and then how much the bright colors are going to pop against that the yellow abs and that star are gorgeous uh, so i think that's going to be 
One of the most striking things about this kit is that the background, which there's lots at the top of this, this is gonna be lots of shades of dark blue, as are these sections at the bottom, like all this dark blue. And then the focal point is just this beautiful, colorful, magical um, area that I think is, the contrast I think is gonna be so stunning, so incredibly stunning. Uh, you can see some of the colors that are happening, like these pretty pastels, almost like a, this almost gives me like a 90s vibe in a really good way. Uh, but I think that this is gonna be so pretty. I wish I could have finished more uh, before this, needing to film this bit for the video, but I think her skin and her face are rendered beautifully. You can see well, at least this part where she's got her hand and her paintbrush and there's some orange beads in here. Um, I am really truly in love with this piece and a little bit of me is sad I didn't save what's obviously the kind of the, the best area in my opinion uh, for last, but I hope that this just proves to you how beautiful this kid is gonna be and that you're gonna need it. So. Um, I am going to keep working on it. I'm going to be sharing progress over on Instagram and you'll see a post review over here on actually here on my channel once I finished it. So be sure you're, you know, subscribed and I, my Instagram linked in my description box, but <clears throat> you guys, this should absolutely be on your shopping list for the weekend. It's going to be beautiful. Ivy Dolamore is the artist and their artwork seems to turn out incredibly beautifully and really, really well from Diamond Art Club, especially with how Diamond Art Club renders. And I just completing this section here, this looks like this kit is gonna be just more of the same. I think it's gonna be beautiful to work on and the finished product is going to take your breath away. And whether or not you're an artist, a painter like she is, or like they are, um, I think that it's still gonna just bring you tons of joy to work on. So the name of this piece is Away From It All. Like I said, it's by the artist Ivy Dolamore. If you haven't seen the other pieces that Ivy has available with Diamond Art Club, please go and take a look. They're amazing. And it's one of those artists who I own almost every single piece of theirs from Diamond Art Club because I not only love the art, but I also love how they turn out too. So, and they sell out quickly. They sell out really quickly. I have a feeling this one's gonna sell out really quickly as well. So if this is on your shopping list for tomorrow, which tomorrow's um, Saturday, July 22nd, uh, be sure you have your alarm set. Cause like I said, I just, I have a hunch this one's gonna sell fast and we never know how much Diamond Art Club's ordered and whether or not kits are gonna be restocked. So the, the, the release times, 9.30 a.m. Pacific, 12.30 p.m. Eastern, that's the general release time. And if you are in the Diamond or Ruby tier of the rewards program, you get an early access window that technically starts at 9 a.m. Pacific, noon Eastern, but sometimes you'll get that email or text message with the with the access linked as, as early as 45 minutes early or you know 15 minutes before that official window starts. So uh, anyway, best of luck to you if you're shopping. Thanks for watching. Thanks to Diamond Art Club for sending this over. Again, it's a beauty. I can't wait to keep working on it. Uh, but ooh, a really, really quick note. I was gonna show you guys Kit It Up. This kit has 73 colors, which I kit up usually into my Elizabeth Ward trays. And I, I just ended up being like, okay, I want them all to fit in one tray. So I do have little Ziploc bags of the colors that I couldn't quite fit into the containers here. Like I couldn't fit all the 823 or couldn't fit all the 336. So I'll just refill it as I go. But there's that pretty color spread. Lots of blues, lots of beautifulness. Okay, you guys, that's it for real this time. I hope you have an amazing weekend. Uh, happy shopping. Let me know in the comments if this one's on your list. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.